<clears throat> yeah, yeah. Um, I, I don't know what's gonna go down here shortly. Uh, but uh, I'm not gonna go out, you know, without taking a few of my enemy with uh, enemies with me. I, I, I just, uh, I just want to let everybody know that um, I, I was trained by the most. Uh, I was trained by the uh, the second of the fiftieth Bushmasters and second platoon Bravo Company. The, the, and the most intense fucking training you could go through in, in the uh, in the United States Army basic training, and, and uh, I had a uh, an extra month of special training. Uh, but anyway, um, specialized training. It, 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 I don't want them, people to misconstrue uh, what I mean by special. Uh, it was specialized training, an extra hour, some basic training for four months rather than three. Uh, but anyway, um, yeah, I'm, I'm not going to just uh, go go out and, you know, I'm not going to let my enemy kill me <clears throat> without without taking out a few of them with me. Um, so, uh, anyway, uh, I'm, not, you know, I'm not making any specific threats. I'm just putting it out there. You know, if I go down, some of, some of you are going to go with me. But y'all got to decide which ones you want to be, which, which one of you want to be the ones that go, go out with me. You know, and go go out into uh into the the uh, unknown with me. Uh, you know, but uh, <clears throat> this 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 video, I, I just want to clear things up. I'm not a liar. I, I I do not intend to lie. Everybody makes mistakes, and sometimes people see things they don't remember things properly, or it's just they, they get muddled up in the head, or uh, you know what uh. You know, I, I'm not a liar. I don't, uh, I, I will, well, I, I, I will say this. In, in a hostile situation, when you're dealing with enemies, yeah, yeah, you got to lie. You got to lie to your enemy. You got to deceive them. It's called false information, disinformation. Yeah, of course. But but in, in, in normal, everyday circumstances, I endeavor to, to be truthful. So I, I inadvertently uh, spoke untruth. In one of my earlier videos uh, about the Bible and what Jesus says about meet, meeting out, uh, whatever. The, 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 I went back and read that just, just to make sure to check. And, and I was quite, uh, I, I was kind of, uh, I had a little bit of a surprise. Uh, the, the scripture I was, uh, referring to was, uh, <clears throat> during the, uh, the, the sermon on the, the sermon on the mount. And, uh, Jesus was actually talking to, uh, those that would follow him. And he basically was saying, um, you know, uh, to, you know, be good to people that persecute you, da 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 da, da. and uh, judge not lest you be judged, and da 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 da, and and with the same measure that you judge and, and mete out judgment on others, the same will be meted unto you. So that that's the truth of that matter. I, I don't want to misconstrue. I I, I don't want to. Uh, I, I don't want to speak words of the Bible that are not actually in there or change them in any way. The Bible says, it says, in, it says in the, in, I think it just, just, just at the ending of the book of Revelation, the last book in the Bible, uh, do, do not change or omit or add to anything in this book. And, and so a lot of people say that that's just for the book of Revelations, but the, the entire word of God is the book. The entire word of God is the book. Every inspired word of God is the book, and that that, that, is, that there's there's other there's other uh, Abrahamic you know religions that that basically teach the same thing. But uh, the, 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 from Abraham from Abraham on, <clears throat> it, it's the book. It's God. It's God's inspired word. But anyway, um, as I was saying, <clears throat> I will say this: uh, Jesus also told. Uh, <clears throat> Jesus told the uh, his disciples, uh, "If your brother, uh, if if your brother or neighbor offend thee, then rebuke him. But if he comes back in the same hour and, and, and begs forgiveness, then forgive him. But again, if he comes back later and and offends offends thee, then rebuke him again. And but if he comes back in the same hour, begs forgiveness, forgive him." See, it's it's uh, you, you, you can't. Jesus gives gives uh, Jesus gives uh, permission 
to hold ought, ought is a grudge or, or, or gripe or whatever, uh, hold ought against your, your, bro, your fellow man or, or woman, whatever the case may be, if they are not repentant, if they are not sorry for having offended you, if they do not seek re reconciliation with you, then, then you're free to not forgive them. That that's that that's in the Bible. I'm I'm speaking the truth. This this is straight up. That's not mixed in street. It's not wrong. It's not jumbled up. <clears throat> it's the proper, you know, straight up scripture. <clears throat> um, you can find that in the Gospels. And also, uh, after Jesus uh, uh, resurrected from the uh, you know whatever, uh, and he was getting ready to make his departure, uh, he bre he breathed upon the the uh, disciples. He breathed them. He breathed them. He, he actually literally breathed out onto them and said, Receive ye the Holy Spirit. And uh, he told them some things, gave them some final instructions. And, and one of the instructions he gave them was this <clears throat> Whatever you loose in heaven will be loosed on earth. And whatever you bind on earth shall be bound in heaven. And, and uh, another one, uh, that, that I think follows that is uh, <clears throat> whatever sins you retain of others, they shall be retained. And whatever, uh, that was backwards. Whatever sins you forgive others of, they will be forgiven. And whatever sins you retain against others, they shall be retained. So there you go. You've got two different sources in the Bible where Jesus gives his followers the permission and in the pro the proper way, in the proper circumstances, to not forgive people. So, you know, there you go. Uh, that that's a, that you'll find that in the Gospels. That that's not that's not muddled or uh, messed you know, bent, you know, confused or you know, whatever. It, it, I told it like it is. I was wrong on the one, and I, I'm one here right now correcting that uh, because when I'm wrong, I'm wrong, and I admit when I'm wrong. And I, I endeavor to speak the truth, especially about spiritual matters. But uh, I, I, I've, I'm going on to cite other scriptures and speak them correctly, citing instance, two specific in instances where Jesus gives his followers permission under the right circumstances to hold against people and not forgive.